right, so in a lot of instances, we maybe only need to pull a few T-posts. Uh, certainly, I think there's a better method, uh, maybe a, getting buying a specific tool for T-post pulling or using a tractor front end loader to pull them out. But if you only have to pull a few T-posts at a time, or if you're like me and don't have access to all those tools, maybe you could use this method right here. So this here, T-post uh, driver, probably got you in this position in the first place by hammering down that T-post, but what you'll go ahead and do is post it in the ground and then put it directly beneath one of the teeth on the T-post. You'll then, with two hands and your foot posted on the bottom, pull back, and it got came up just a little bit. We'll then walk it to the next tooth, pull back, and as you can see, we'll work our way down until we have effectively pulled the T-post out of the ground. Again, not the most optimal method out there, but does a really good job, and if you only need to do it for a few, may save you a trip running back to the barn or to the house to grab that pulling tool or whatever you're doing. There you go. Follow K County OSU Extension on social media to keep up to date on upcoming events, educational information, and research-based information. Thank you for watching.